we are just now learning, and CNN has this exclusively right now. A short time ago, the U.S. Air Force dropped a 21,000-pound bomb in eastern Afghanistan, the first use ever of this weapon in combat. This is a weapon called the Massive Ordnance Air Blast Bomb. It was dropped in eastern Afghanistan in Nangarhar province against a complex of ISIS tunnels, personnel that had been assembling in that area of Nangarhar. The U.S. military had this weapon in development for years, but now today, just a few hours ago, dropping the bomb in combat, according to U.S. officials, for the first time ever. This massive 21,000-pound bomb, we have video we're showing of the testing of the bomb, but again, not used in combat until today, we are told. This is such a heavy bomb, such a large bomb. It is put in the back of a cargo plane, a special operations cargo plane, and basically pushed out the back of it. Now they've dropped it on this ISIS complex of fighters in eastern Afghanistan. This is an area where just a few days ago, a U.S. special operations soldier was killed in action in a firefight with ISIS fighters. It's an area the U.S. has been trying to go after to clear ISIS out of there. An extraordinary use of this weapon um, to put uh, mildly how seriously the U.S. Air Force takes this bomb. The official name is the Massive Ordnance Air Blast Bomb, M-O-A-B, Moab. The nickname inside the Air Force for this, quite seriously, is the mother of all bombs.